America stay overseas and go down to the Philippines, where the son of a former dictator is the projected winner in that country's presidential election. Ferdinand Marcos Jr., a.k.a. Bong Bong, appears to have won by a wide margin. If you recognize the name, it's because his father is ousted former dictator Ferdinand Marcos, who was known for astounding corruption. It's an election that could have broad implications for America's influence in that region. And our Elizabeth Palmer has more. The ecstatic crowds at his rallies hinted Ferdinand Bongbong Bong Marcos would win. But his landslide marks not only a victory for the candidate, but a comeback for one of Asia's most infamous political families. Marcos lovers and haters crowded into polling stations Monday to cast their ballots. After six years of populist rule by the outgoing president, Rodrigo Duterte, alleged to have ordered extrajudicial killings of drug dealers, there was huge support for the current vice president and human rights lawyer, Lenny Robredo. But she was no match for the Marcos machine, which delivered a clear majority of millions of votes. Bong bong sara! Bong Bong, that's him on the right, was a teenager when his father, Ferdinand Marcos, was president. But after more than a decade of epic corruption, human rights abuses, and martial law, Filipinos rose up in 1986, and Marcos and his family fled the country. Furious mobs overran the presidential palace, famously discovering First Lady Imelda Marcos's collection of thousands of shoes. Ferdinand Marcos died three years later, having embezzled billions of dollars. Fast forward to 2022. Bong Bong, now 64, cast his vote on Monday along with his mother Imelda. Their pitch to the voters? A Marcos in power means not corruption and abuse, but stability and security. At home, they bought it. Abroad, not so much. A Marcos presidency is not likely to be close to the United States. That's because Marcos faces a contempt order here and millions of dollars in penalties linked to the money embezzled by his family decades ago. But for millions of Filipinos, that's ancient history. And Bong Bong is now their champion of tomorrow. For CBS Mornings, I'm Elizabeth Palmer 